Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Life of a Blonde. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe below. Also, make sure you check out the um, description for some discount codes for um, a couple companies for Barrel Naturals and Coffee and Nirvana. Just so you guys know, um, it is my birthday coming up, so I'm gonna try to be on as much as possible. But um, I really do appreciate you guys. In the last 24 hours, I gained um, from five subscribers to 163 and I don't even know how this happened, but I am so grateful God is so amazing and I'm just so thankful and so happy and if I could get myself to like I don't even know 500 subscribers. I think I would fucking piss my pants. I literally think that I would die like I this is what I love and I love to share my life with you guys and, and I really just appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video It does mean a lot to me um, you guys have literally no idea how much it means to me like you guys are the reason why I started a YouTube channel because so many of my friends and even random people I didn't know used to come up to me and be like oh uh, your makeup's so amazing are you on YouTube what it's just about doing what you love and for me this is something that I love so I really appreciate the fact that I get to share that with you guys and you guys are along with me on my journey of life as well Hello though. Oh, excuse my pimple. The shade. two concealers. I have the NYX HD Studio in Porcelain and ELF in Light Beige. So you're going to go ahead and blend that in. stand these pimples. Now the e.l.f. is more of my foundation color, but it just helps to kind of blend a little bit. Um, you know, and if I do have really, really bad dark eyes, um, I will go in with the um, e.l.f. color correcting stick in um, light for light skin tones. Um, and the orange kind of helps balance out the um, darkness under the eyes. Another trick that I'm going to use is the um, Touch and Soul Liquid Foundation in um, number 23 Natural Beige. I actually use that um, under my eyebrows once I fill them in, but today I'm going to use that under my eyes because I really don't feel 
like using the color correcting stick today. I'm not going out anywhere. Um, I'm just doing this quick tutorial for you guys so I can start posting more and keeping you guys more updated. The only thing that I don't like about the touch and sole is you have to make sure you use a lot of setting powder um, because the touch and sole foundation does tend to get extremely, extremely um, like uh, full of creases. It gets really creasy, so you have to make sure that you set it very well. As you can see, magic. And I'm just gonna add a little bit up here. Um, actually, you know what I'm gonna do is take my foundation and um, go ahead and add a little bit of foundation with my finger right there. I'm just gonna let it sit there for a minute, a nice minute. Sweet. And you are gonna see, for the most part, it's pretty concealed. You'd be surprised. I hate having pimples. All right, so, next step moving on. Now we are gonna go on to setting powder. And of course, I'm such a big fan of the Maybelline Fit Me family that I'm also gonna go in with the Maybelline um, Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. Super, super light and um, fair light because I do like it extremely, extremely light. And of course, I'm gonna take my under eye sponge because I want it set very well. And I'm just gonna dab and just kind of shake it off. And so I'm gonna leave this there for a couple minutes while I work on these babies. just my preference I prefer my brows extremely dark um, I know I am blonde but I really do like my dark eyebrows because as you can see they're super super light and in most lightings you can't even see them and then I look like I'm eyebrowless and I just took a razor and I shaved it off for fun studio like I said I love Maybelline so much in the tattoo studio it did come with the um, bristle brush so I'm just gonna use that to go and uh, quickly brush my eyebrows so today I'm gonna do my eyebrows a little bit different small angled brush see, from um, elf and I'm just gonna go ahead and paint it a little bit and I'm gonna put it back and since I already filled them in with the pencil I'm just kind of gonna go in so you can see the um, Revlon Bra Fantasy and of course it's still baking <sighs> too bad I'm not actually baking and of course if you have darkly colored eyebrows there is no need for you to use any of this so I'm gonna go ahead and take my giant powder brush from elf and just I 
very dark under eye circles. So as you can tell, hey dark eyes. So okay now, so we're gonna move on to brows, and um, I'm gonna go ahead and use the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. Um, as you can see, I've barely used it. I still have the um, covering on the mirror. Um, I'm just really obsessed with it. Like it is one of my favorite palettes. Um, maybe it's because of the color of my eyes or I'm not sure my skin tone, but the way that it, the colors just fit on my eyes is amazing and they're all so pigmented. Like, look, I'm gonna go in with Ember. Look at that, look at that. Ready? Like, one swap, one swap. It's amazing. All right, so now we are gonna move on. Let me just wipe that off there. I just have, hate having everything. And that's just a glittery shade. Um, we can go in with a matte shade. We'll go in with Sauced. Let me use a different finger. It's a matte shade. So you can see there, that's still from the other finger. And we'll go next to it. Like, excuse me, hello, pigment. It's amazing, like literally amazing. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start the eyes. Okay, so we're gonna start with the eyes now. Um, I'm gonna be using the Urban Decay palette. I feel like I'm gonna go for something more neutral today um, because I did have the amazing um, new Ardell Magnetic Lashes to show you guys. I wanna start off with Chaser, my bad. try a cut crease today so after I went in with chaser I'm gonna go in with um, cayenne blend and blend I'm gonna do a cut crease so my shades have been matte so far very basic and simple. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take in the shade and Fuego. Okay, so now I'm gonna take the um, Touch and Soul and Natural Base, which I use as a concealer. I'm just gonna go ahead and I have this little um, detailer brush and I'm gonna go ahead and just put a little, little tidbit, like little, little tiny bit on and I'm gonna start with the cut crease. is I have a Maybelline just fit me ugly old flat powder I'm gonna go ahead 
and dip my brush into that and just go on top so I can go ahead and dry out my cup crease so I can go ahead and start working on my eyes again. And once I did that, I'm gonna now go back in with the Enfuego and just work it in. go ahead and I'm gonna use this beautiful scorched it is a glittery shade let me swatch it for you guys that's it on my finger and you know what we're gonna go right down the arm like so look at that how amazing is that that's literally like amazing so I'm gonna go and take Scorched and I'm just gonna pat it onto my eyelids. And like I said, because the touch and sole is very creasy, the eyeshadow helps to go ahead and set it, especially since before I went ahead and I put on the glittery eyeshadow, um, the metallic shade, before I went ahead and put it on, um, I did use a little bit of powder to mat it out. And there you have it. I always go like that just to keep my cut creases looking uh, on bleak. So. We're gonna go ahead and take the Urban Decay Afterglow um, Highlighting Palette. And, hint, hint, it's one of my favorite, favorite, favorite fucking, like, highlight palettes in the world. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the shade um, Wicked with this um, blending brush I have from Scone and just go ahead and put it in the corner of my eye to help bring everything together like a little bundle okay so we're ready guys so these are the double dummy um no not double dummy these are the one tens the ardell magnetic lashes now literally about these i only had to trim like two lashes off and they literally like they fit perfectly and perfect like i don't know who made these but these are like goddess lashes these are perfect perfect lashes this is a smile smile see smile because i love i love my lashes no just wanted to say that I got the most amazing glow cream in the mail, the Hyaluronic Acid Serum from Barrel Naturals. Um, my skin right now um, is actually really pimply because I'm on my period is that time of month, but um, you know, this stuff makes your skin amazing, amazing. It's got witch hazel and everything like that, and um, another one of my favorite things is Trader Joe's uh, Facial Toner. Now. Um, they did send this to me um, to go ahead and try it out, and I absolutely loved it, so um, I'm like raving about it to everyone I know. And so I'm going to go ahead and set my makeup, which I have not done. I go ahead and use my rose water facial toner from Trader Joe's, just because one, it's $3.99. $3.99. And two they don't test on animals and it's like organic and it smells good it's good for you and another thing that i just wanted to point out to you guys check out these amazing beautiful beautiful freaking earrings let me let me get close for y'all
this amazing, beautiful, lovely blogger and jewelry maker, Coffee and Nirvana, sent me these and I literally absolutely love them. They are like so organic and so beautiful. Like, who, who you wearing? No, this is not Givenchy. This is fucking Coffee and Nirvana, bitch. Thanks. Coffee and Nirvana. So y'all need to head over to coffeeandnirvana.com. I'm going to put the link in the description right there, coffeeandnirvana.com. You guys got to head over there now because she doesn't just have earrings. She also has necklaces. She is a blogger, so there's a blog you can read, which is actually pretty damn good. And on top of that, it's at great prices too. And so is the Barrel Naturals Hyaluronic Acid. Right now it's on sale for $21. Um, for Coffee and Nirvana, my discount code is going to be listed below. I believe it is Melody10, if I'm not correct, to save some moolah. Because you know, we're always on a budget. We're always spending. We work our hard asses off and we don't want to be spending our money, honey. Super expensive. So, again, these are the beautiful earrings. You should head over to Coffee and Nirvana right now to go and get yours. Also, head over to Barrel Naturals to get your Glow Hyaluronic Acid on sale before it runs out because my skin has never had pimples like this for like ever but it's a time of months so you know but usually I have really clear skin and everybody always compliments how my skin is so clear and to be honest I even sleep in my makeup I never take it off I'm lazy I'm so lazy Beautiful.